Welcome back, I am Nito Marquis, and before I begin this, if you're watching this right now, thank you very much for coming, thank you for watching this, if anybody that subscribed is watching this, thank you for the subscribers. So, at the time of this recording, I am aware that I am a small YouTuber at best, I have under 10 subscriptions, but truly, the fact that I'm seeing people subscribe, it feels good. Um, you guys are awesome. I can't wait to see this channel grow because I'm starting to see small steps and I know that someday it's going to be larger steps and this is great. Uh, I'm going to try to improve every day that I can because I know my editing could use work, I know my equipment could use work, and I know that my battling skills could use work because I'm pretty bad right now. Uh, so let's continue on with the adventure here. This is my playthrough of Moon and I appear to be lost already so that's lovely. Here's where the cut's gonna end, because I remembered where to go. I gotta water these pseudo wudo. Completely forgot about that for about five seconds. As I was saying, thank you so much for watching. I really hope that this is enjoyment to you and me. I hope that I can, uh, I can at least express how much fun I'm having playing this game. And I hope you guys enjoy it with me. Now let's water some pseudo wudo. I gotta use a Z move on them. Okay, I guess not. They're just gonna run. The battle, what was that? I, I missed it. I'm sorry. Let's see here. The pseudo wudo, once they reminded of that Z move. I thought they would like the Z move. They wanted to be watered. Alright, well, what do I get from you? Mystic water. Okay. Maybe that'll go on Pop Squeak. Battle Royale Dome. Or Battle Royal Dome. That's a place where you can enter Battle Royals. Okay. Now let's go take a look at this. Let's go take a look at this then. I don't want to battle you. Alright, can I get by you? Yes. Alright. I will come back and battle trainers. Don't whoa, whoa. Whoa, that thing's awesome. What is that? Can you come to my aid? Um, great. Team Skull. I am really glad that I healed up now. Hey! He's got an abductor as well. I love this music. I love Team Skull. Yo, yo, yo. Don't go turning your backside on us. And you. You're that numbskull trainer from Mele Mele. Yo. Hey, you guys made it over. Where'd you get a boat? These scoundrels and Pokemon thieves. Or are Pokemon thieves. And you're on familiar terms with them. Uh, it's a long story. Yeah, I know them. Yeah, that's right, you do. I'm Hapu. Life in the big city sure is something else. Pokemon thieves roam around brazenly. Eh, yeah, thieves, that's a loose term. You gotta steal something successfully before you can be classified as a thief. We're no thieves, it's a legitimate business. We got straight messed up in Mele Mele, got exiled to Akala, but we ain't going out like that. Let's do it! Battling Team Skull is like a highlight for me. I love Battling Team Skull. Now, the only problem is I know Gladion's out there. And he's actually an awesome rival. I love the idea of Gladion just being total badass and all that. And uh, the only problem is these guys, they're not so much on Gladion's level. So I guess you could say that it's not exactly the battle I enjoy. It's more the dialogue. Foe, cut him up. Uh, you know what? I forgot I have Fury Cutter on this thing. That's gonna hurt. You picked a Psychic type. That makes you... I think that makes you Grunt B. I didn't check. I'll see in a moment. Oh. Foe, you need, you need better stats. That Drowsy has some defense. And he's using headbutt. Don't you dare start this. Okay, good. Crit? Yeah! I didn't crit, but I high rolled. Didn't know I was that close to taking it out. Foe. You're a foe mantis, but I have no idea what you evolve into. You are a new Pokemon to me. Y lens up. And once again, bone dry. Which grunt were you? I could sit here all day and just listen to this music. With all these losses, you're going to anger our bosses. 
These tears taste like salt, yo. It's all your fault, yo. Yeah, it's because uh, you're salty now. You lost Floon. Drift Loon. What the heck is that thing? Mudsdale. Oh, that must be uh, that that donkey-looking thing's evolution. Uh, I can't even remember that. Mudbray, I think. Shall we stop these scoundrels? Well, if you could have, why didn't you do that earlier? All right, it'll be a mess to clean up afterward, but I will I? Okay, oh, God. <laughs> these guys are like, oh, no, wait a minute. She's talking about actually attacking us, not our Pokemon. Time for us to break out, yo. Gotta tell y'all, peace out. I'm not gonna keep telling you this, except when I keep telling you this. Hey, words of wisdom. You better listen to what my homie says and drill it into that thick skull of yours. Seriously, you better not forget, numbskull. Hey, you guys are hilarious. You'll be fine getting home. Oh, okay, that was... Wait a minute, It was that a wild Pokemon? I've got to thank you for that. Give me your name, trainer. Marquis, eh? That's a fine name. I like the way you handled yourself in battle. Mudsdale and I are always wa wandering all about Alola trying to achieve our goals. So perhaps we'll meet it one day again. So I have to ask, was that Driftloon wild? Because how can you steal a wild Driftloon? Isn't that just catching a Pokemon? Battle Royal. Mudsdale here. Uh, okay, what's a Battle Royal? Um, if this is some kind of minigame, I'm not quite interested. Oh, it looks like that is the goal, as I have to go in here. Oh, this place is so nice at night. And to get night, I have to play in the day, which is rare for me. Machamp. And what was the other balloon over there? I didn't see it. Oh, it's Gladion. I should have healed up. Humph. Why do I do this? Every time something brings me down, I end up coming right back here again. And Come on, Null. Let's go bury our sorrow in the crowd. Type Null. All right, I'm up. I definitely want to battle that. All right. Well, I'm going to follow Gladion because I want to get another battle with him. Oh, yeah, here we go. Here we go. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Glad you could make it. Who is this guy? A luchador. I'm here today. Battle Royal. They call me the Masked Royal. Professor? <laughs> That's great. I'm here to teach down a little for generations in the Battle Royal. But Royal, what's the Battle Royal, you might ask? Four trainers. Four trainers. Each pick three Pokemon. All right. I definitely want to get in on this, but if Gladion's in there, it's going to be... Yeah, I better bring something that's not so weak. And Howe's here, of course. All right, so it's going to be How, me, Gladion, and probably the Masked Royal. Yep. That's what I figured it was going to be. And it's going to come down to Gladion and I, because Gladion uh, clearly is a well-seasoned battler. Okay, uh, how's this going to work, though? You got four Pokemon all at once. Charizard, Gyarados. I like these entrances. All right. Here come the contenders. Tyranitar. I didn't get to see the fourth one. Okay. Now, I've got three Pokemon. Foe's not exactly Toracat. Oh, I'm already going to have to switch out. Professor's using his Rock Ruff, and Gladion's using Type Null. Oh, there it is again. Okay. All right. The battle starts now. Yeah, you know what my first move is? Switch. Oh, I'm still poisoned. I forgot to... Oh, that's not good. That's all I've got is a poisoned foe? Um... Why didn't I heal up? I thought I did. 
Oh, no, no, no. I made the choice not to. Alright. I said I wasn't going to wipe, but I've got a Type Null out there and a second stage Fire Starter while I'm poisoned. This was a disaster. Go for the Rock Rough. Actually, no, you know what? No, take it back. Use, uh, use Razor Leaf. Hit them all. And maybe they'll take each other out. I'm out. I'm out. All right, I lost. I did not mean to lose. Oh, I didn't mean to lose. I should have checked. I should have checked. I should have checked. I would have used... Pi oh, I, I would have used Pop Squeak. I'm sorry. You even have a shot at being a real... Okay, yeah. You were on fire during that battle. Who's this guy? I hope you bring that fire with you and burn up my trial. Okay, so... He's got a trial as well, and he also looks pretty fierce. The name is Kiawe. Okay, they said that was Kiawe earlier. You can get to Wella Volcano Park from Route 7. I'll be waiting for you. Um, yeah, I'm not going to bring an injured Fomantis next time, so... That was, uh... I, I hope I didn't miss out on anything. But why are you here? Why do you even want to battle Royal? Yeah, Gladion. I didn't even make it to Gladion because I had the wrong Pokemon. Because Noel and I have to make it on our own. Don't you ever forget that. Well, uh, that was entertaining. I should have used Pop Squeak. Why didn't it let me choose? I didn't mean to get destroyed like that. Alright. Well, that's embarrassing. That's really embarrassing. Back to the Poke Center. So, I'm talking to... Uh, Hypno. He, he, he. That's extremely dangerous to have a Hypno just kind of standing there with children around. Come on. Interesting music and interesting land. I love the layout of all the areas. I just wish it weren't so hold my hand, but... Either way, this is, uh... Oh, hey, a battle. Into the volcano I go. Uh, typically it's not a good thing to go in the volcano. Okay, there are the gates. Um, I don't want to go that way. Who is this? Good job making it this high. Yes, heal my Pokemon, please. Alright, through the gates. I was going to talk to that guy. I forgot. Alright, I guess I have a trial right now. Let's go. A totem Pokemon it is. Now, Kiawe, what kind of totem Pokemon would you have? You are shredded, man. My Marowak and I are students of the ancient dances that have been passed around for generations. The trial of Kiawe. You will find it a bit different than the trials you've faced up to this point, but of course, you will attempt it. Yeah. Let's bring it on, a Marowak. Trial start. My trial will test the powers of observation. There will be a dance, and there will be another. Your task will be to find the differences between the two. Oh, dude, really? Yeah, I, uh, I don't think I want to do this. What was that? Watch carefully and memorize the dance. Okay. God, that Pokemon is awesome. What was different from the previous dance? Show me again, because I was just watching how awesome Marowak is. His fire is not very animated, though. Like, that's weird fire. It looks like it's just really strange. What was difference? Truly spectacular! And to add to the spectacle... Come on, Marowak. Let me, yes, there we go. I was going to say, let me battle him. Totem Marowak or just regular Marowak? A wild Marowak? I can catch him. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm going to get one of these awesome Marowaks. I am going to make sure. Uh, you know what? I really hope that this is a good competitive Pokemon. I want a Marowak maxed out. I want this thing trained up. And he's got cursed body. Ooh. That's not exactly good. I'm going to have to switch out because my other moves are really going to hurt you. Alright, so if he's a ghost and ground type, 
then I think the best thing to do would actually just be go with Abductor. I will use Disarm, I mean not Disarm, I'll use Ominous Wind, which will be neutral, but I will raise my stats, so I hope. It's not a very high chance of my stats going up. But I outspeed every time. So hopefully my stats go up. Um, there we go. I was, okay, I was going to say, not neutral. I, I didn't mean to say neutral earlier. I meant to say super effective. But uh, Abductor's attack isn't that high, so... He's misspeaking. I have to go back and correct everything all the time. All right. Perfect. You can't catch a Pokemon... In, ah, that's right. I'm in the trial. That... Ah. It doesn't matter. I had a great move there. And he's not a ghost ground. He's a... I guess dark? I, I'm not really sure. Ghost fire? Everybody's up. Do I have another... Evolving? Marowak was so pleased by your red answer that it simply had to battle you. Well, appreciate that. Onward to the second dance. Alright, here we go. Carefully watch and memorize this dance. Who is that? I'm confused. The hiker? What? Does that count? A guy literally just jumps in the picture and that counts? Do I have to face the hiker now? Yeah, I do. Hiker David, who are you? Get out of here. Magmar? You're gonna... Oh, uh, you know, for a second I was gonna say, is that a Lolan Magmar? That would be awesome. You're gonna send a Magmar out against my pup squeak? You are gonna get destroyed. You're gonna outspeed, right? Yeah, so... I'll take the hit, because I know that this bubble beam is going to take you down. And if it doesn't, then I'll use the Akajet. It's a simple strategy. See ya. Hiker David. How is that supposed to be a challenge? You're a weird looking dude. But um, that seemed oddly irrelevant. My hiker friend was so pleased. Okay, Kiawe, this is getting ridiculous. You looked like you were a really tough trainer. I'll give it to him this. What is this guy doing? Carefully watch and memorize this dance. They're trying to... Really? What is that thing? So, they're trying to... Uh, the black Pokemon? The suspicious Pokemon? I'm gonna go with the suspicious Pokemon. Because Marowak is black. Sala. Oh, that's it. Totem battle it is. I was going to say, I appreciate the effort. Totem Salazzle. Dude, that thing looks awesome. Wow. Aura Flare. It's special defense, Rose. All right. Best guess, it's either Fire Dark or Fire Dragon. Or maybe it's Dark Dragon. No, it wouldn't be Dark Dragon. That wouldn't make sense because we're on a volcano. It's going to be Fire. And it's going to be Dragon. So, uh, he's just going to set up with a simple Toxic. I'm going to probably take this thing out pretty quickly. Although, he's probably going to call for backup. So, let's hit him with the Bubble Beam. Maybe slow him down. Come on, drop his speed. Alright, he's going to call for backup right now. But yes, he's definitely a Fire type. I got that far. Salazzle so called its allies. And Salandit appeared. Okay, so Salandit must be the pre evolve. Alright, Bubble Beam, lower his speed, please, because he's just going to keep out speeding and he might actually pick away at Pup Squeak now that I'm poisoned. Venom Drench? It ain't going to do anything. You already got me poisoned. Oh, uh, you know what? I'm starting to take. Uh, I'm starting to think that he might be a fire poison type. It's hard to tell. But at least I got as far as to know that you're uh, definitely a uh, fire type. What are you eating? Don't be a citrus berry. Special attack. Perfect. That is fine. Venoshock. Again, not going to do much. But that toxic's going to take me out soon. 
All right, uh, Pop Squeak's going down right now, but that Salazzle is going down first. So here we go. Come on, Pup Squeak, you got this. You got this. Take him out. His special defense is high, but that wasn't enough, was it? See ya. Because your defense, since that was a physical move, I believe. Wylan, Abductor is level 24. Foe is level 29. All right. Pup Squeak, thank you for the good fight. Farewell. Saland it. Um, if you are a poison type and you are... Oh, that would be a bad idea. Let's just bring out uh, Wylan. There's not a whole lot you can do at this point, Salandit. Although I am impressed. These things are pretty high level. Or keeping up with me in level. Yep. No problem. Just continue to land that cross job. And that's it. Another totem Pokemon down. Kind of feels like little mini bosses. So I will say this much for Moon. There's always something going on. This is definitely a very uh, fast game. Uh, even though it's holding my hand, it's definitely a very fast-paced game. I do appreciate that. And look at that half moon. Keen observations, different dances. You defeated the totem Pokemon with such ease. Fire oh, I'm sorry, Fireum. I was going to say uh, Firium. Fireum Z is now yours. Well, that was easy. Well, sort of. Again, I feel like these are mini-bosses, if anything. I didn't get a chance to guess what that Z-Crystal's name was going to be. I forgot. I already broke my own tradition. It's only existed for a few episodes. But, hey, this trial was nice. Um, yes, they feel like mini-bosses. I'm not going to say that they're exactly the hardest battles I've ever done, but uh, Gym Leader is certainly a little more intimidating than this. All right, show me the Fire-type Z-Move. Nice. Thank you, my dear Marowak. I think Marowak's out. I, oh, you know what? Earlier I made a mistake. I think uh, I said Ghost Ground. Uh, he's Fire Ghost, I think. That would make a lot more sense. Alright, got some Quick Balls from Kiawe. Uh, the Pokemon Charizard. Dude, I'm just getting all these awesome Pokemon, and they're not on my party. They're just uh, moving me around. All right, well, I think uh, in our dance, and so we must dance on, and onward we shall dance. Thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate every single view I get and all the feedback. Please uh, comment below, and you know what? That's, that's all I got, guys. You know the drill. Everybody knows how YouTube works. Just know that I'm really thankful that anybody would watch this and be entertained by me having a blast here just playing Pokemon Moon. This game is awesome. Um, I definitely just am having a ball doing this. This is great. Even though the battles were somewhat... E well, okay, they were easy, except I just got destroyed by how That was an accident, so feel free to roast me or whatever you want to do. That was uh, unfortunate. My bad. Take care, and until next time, meet a murky out.